Arbor, we're getting closer to kickoff. One of the great things about college football is the respect for the past. And a perfect story of that is what Danielle Dwyer has right now for us. Dan, you're exactly right. The original Michigan super fan, Jeff Holzhausen, has a tradition that I got to witness, and it was awesome. It's called the Grave Walk, something that happens every Tuesday night leading up to the annual Michigan-Ohio State game. It was started by Michigan alum and superfan Jeff Holzhausen in 1992 during his freshman year. He says he wanted to pay a personal tribute to some of football's greats. In 1997, he opened it up to the Michigan community, and since then, it's continued to grow to nearly 100 people joining in on the walk. You can't manufacture tradition. You can't manufacture this feeling or community. Michigan fans of all ages join Holzhausen to walk from the campus clock tower to Forest Hill Cemetery to pay their respects to Bo Schembechler, Fielding H. Yost, and broadcaster Bob Eufer. At each grave, Holzhausen says a speech. For Schembechler, he says he's his football godfather. He also says he's excited to have coach Jim Harbaugh back in the big house because it means the next golden era of Michigan football is upon us. Little did Holzhausen know coach Harbaugh was standing behind him during the speech. It wasn't until Holzhausen asked the crowd if they wanted to say anything that Harbaugh made his presence and respect for his former coach known. Nine years ago, pretty close to the day, uh, we were here for coach's funeral and just uh, deep abiding respect for Bo Schembechler as a coach, as a father figure, as a leader, um, and, and wanted to be here. And it was great to connect with all these, uh, these Michigan students, alumni, and people that have such a great love and passion for the University of Michigan. And it was a moment that left Holzhausen in shock. I about cried. I, I, uh, I've been hearing it was going to happen for about a month and couldn't believe it. And it, it was magical. I and mean, I, I meant what I said that one day there's no doubt in my mind that my kids will talk about Coach Harbaugh the same way I co talk about Coach Jim Beckler. Joining Harbaugh was his father, Jack, who coached under Bo, and his daughter, Grace. After the speeches, Holzhausen handed over the Michigan hammer to Coach to allow him to do the honors of smashing a Buckeye, a symbol of what's to come on game day. The group then made the walk to Eufer and Yost Graves, doing the same tradition, a tradition that stands out to more than just the man who started. We talk about the deathless loyalty that uh, that uh, you have talked about uh, way back in the day, and, and you really see that in the, the 60 to 70 to 80 and more that come out here, uh, not just this year, but every year. And it's a love that gives back. Uh, to have a legacy of, of achievement at the highest level, and that's our legacy and our future, and, and you realize it's in the people. great experience for me even though I am a Buckeye fan at heart but we have some Buckeye fans here next to us but right now back to you Dan all right thanks Danielle let's go